everyone, welcome back. If you're new, welcome, my name is Eden. So, today is going to be episode two of a wee series that I started last week, um, where I am testing different sort of super hyped up brands or super advertised brands. So, today I'm going to be testing Shein. So, um, that's pretty much it. I'll just get on with it and I'll stop rambling. Hope you enjoy it. Okay, so I spent £131. No, £14.99 because I got um, a jewellery piece. So it was £131. I ordered it. I'm not sure the exact date I ordered it. I'll put it on screen somewhere. Um, and it came. In fact, what I can do is I have my laptop up here so I can check. But it came this morning. Um, it did say that it was going to come between the 23rd of this month and 27th. So it did come faster. Yeah, so I ordered it on the 11th. So today is the... Oh, it's really not. Oh no, my order was shipped on the 11th. Yeah, no. Oh wow, that's really fast actually. I just looked at that there. So that, only, that took less than a week. Because um, today is the 17th that I'm filming this. So that actually came really fast. Um, so I don't know about oh god, I don't know about anyone else, but especially on TikTok, um, my for you page has been full of Shein, like Shein ads, Shein like people trying stuff out, like testing it, um, various like people sponsored by Shein, um, a huge variety of stuff. So, um, I will say that I have shopped from Shein before. I do own quite a few things from Shein, but with this video I wanted to test the sort of most hyped up products almost and um, the most popular products that I see quite regularly so um, I'll just get on with it it'll be the same sort of format as the last video where I'll I haven't unboxed like unbagged everything everything's still in the wee bags that it comes in I will say although aesthetically it's nice seeing everything in like separate bags it's not very good plastic wise I don't think these are recyclable Mm, it doesn't say so there is a lot of single-use plastic um <clears throat> i think that was every brand um whenever you order from like pretty little thing or anything every, oh God, my, my hair's been on pleats all day but it's really not doing its best so let's not talk about that. that's not what this video's about um yeah a lot of single-use plastic hopefully that's something that will change but again that seems to be quite a common theme with a lot of places from ordering online so I'll just go on showing you the product. So the first thing I have is this little black top. So looks like this. You absolutely cannot see that. Right, so basically <clears throat> it's a little black top that has a little tie like in the middle and there's a wee keyhole. Um, it's quite cute. It's a bit see-through like to be sure I can see my light through it but again I don't think you'd actually be able to see through it. I think it is just the lights. It looks like it's going to be a good size, a good length. Um, quality's okay. It's, I mean, can't say it's great, but like it's Shein, what do you expect? So with size on Shein, um, I'll mention that quickly before I get on with anything else. Every single time, like everything's probably of a different size because I just based off of the reviews. So this wee top is a medium and it says it's a US 6. So I'm sure a US 6 might be a UK 8 or 10. I'm sure there's like one or two differences in size. Like one or two down from us would be the US sizing. So that's what this top looks like. And I'll try that on, see how I feel about it. Okay, so here's the wee black top. No, it's actually quite cute. The only thing I'm not a huge fan of is like when you untie this bit. If I can remember how to untie it. It's not like it ties together, it's just like a bit of fabric that this is sewn into and you just tie it yourself however you would want it. Um, I understand but then I'm also kind of like, because now I can't make the bow sit pretty because you need to like tie it funny. Anyways, that's what it looks like. It's just straight at the back. It's actually quite cute. Yeah. Okay, so the next wee top I have, a lot of it wee tops. Um, I did try and get like 
sorry, that's really annoying. A mixture of things. Um, so the thing I've actually just pulled out the bag is not a wee top at all. So this looks like it's going to be too big. Right, I'm going to get the other thing that I've paired this with because something that I've seen a lot on Shein is um, shirt dresses. I don't know whether that's just the way my Shein is laid out. And our own shirt dress in my life, so I'm not sure why it would be. So I picked up this shirt dress. This is a medium as well. So it's just a shirt dress. It's literally just white. And something that was advertised along with it was one of these little corset things. So yeah, I wish there was a way I could show you this better. Um, so it kind of like goes under your boobs. Kind of corsets in. Um, you know what, this is unlike anything I've ever worn before, I will be honest. I've got a friend who, like I can imagine her wearing this and she would look so cool and I'd be like, I want to wear that. So, that's kind of what it's based off of. <clears throat> this shirt actually feels like a really nice quality. I don't know whether it's going to be super long. Again, we'll see in the try-on clip. I'm hopefully going to not get makeup on anything. That's um, a bit of a common occurrence, which is a bit of an issue, but that's okay. Okay, so here's the shirt dress with this little thing. You know, I'm not actually sure how well it goes. I don't know. This thing would be quite difficult to put on. It's, I don't know how well we can see it, but it's all like brack lips. Um, that's what the back looks like. It's quite short in the back. It's not the shortest thing ever, but keep that in mind. I feel like if it was ironed, and I'd like dressed up properly. I feel like this middle bit is like pulling it up. I'm not sure how I feel about it. I feel like it makes my boobs look a bit funny. <laughs> I don't know. Okay, the next thing I've got is this wee top here. Oh God, this. Right, okay, I was gonna say the material of this feels very strange. So I saw um, a girl on YouTube with this um, called Tia, Tia. Leon, I can't remember what her full name is. Um, she was wearing this top and it looked really nice. It's like a faux leather top. Okay, <laughs> I've seen a lot of people buying from Shein and they've bought faux leather stuff and it smelled really funny. So I'm glad this smells okay. So it's basically just a halter neck top um, and it's just like that in the back. It's like this in the front. I think this could be really cool if it looks nice. Um, okay, so, so here's the leather top. So I've just tied it up my neck. I really did think it was going to be quite difficult to put on because of the material. Um, it's actually right. The only thing is it like keeps flicking up. But you know what? I actually really like it. I think obviously I'm just wearing black flares right now. Um, if I like properly styled it, I actually really like it. I think it adds something a bit different. I think as well because it's that sort of matte looked leather. Um, so obviously you can get like the like shinier stuff as well. I think it looks really nice. Um, I don't know what I'd wear it with, but I'm sure I'll find something. <laughs> okay, next I have this, which I think is a little dress. Yes. They also come with these like little random like papery bits. Um, I can't say that's my favourite thing either. I just think it's a bit wasteful. I don't really see the point in it, but then I suppose if you're trying to return things, you're going to need little bags, but again, I'm not sure. So. This wee dress is again in a medium. It looks quite big. But then again, I think I just have more concept for what size I am. So it looks like this. It's just a cute little summer dress. Um, you know what, this is actually really cute. It's also got a wee under layer in it, which is like completely mesh. So I'm not sure how much use that is gonna be, but it's very cute. I wonder if this wee bit actually does anything. Oh, it does. So it's got one of those little, oh, that's really pretty actually. You can like, sorry I keep looking in the mirror, this must be so round. So it sits like that and you can like scrunch this bit so it like sits a bit smaller or something. I'm not really sure. Just to make the like, neckline to suit you. Um, stretch wise, you know what, it actually feels quite stretchy. Um, I'm excited, I think this will be really cute. I hope it will be really cute, I'm going to be really upset if it's not. <laughs> okay, so here's this little dress. You know what, I actually do think it's so sweet. It's quite see-through, that's the only thing. Um, you'd need to wear nude under it, I think. I do think the neckline is just so pretty. Obviously, again, it's a 
mentioned 704 times. Needs a bit of different brass. That's what the back looks like. It's quite short. Um, you can pull it. I have managed to pull it down actually. Um, I do think it's really pretty. I would probably wear it like a wee bit scrunched up so it's not as see through. Makes it a wee bit shorter, a bit more my style, I think. But honestly, this is so sweet. I can see one of my friends really liking this. Like, I feel like she might text me after I've posted this. <laughs> so, the next thing, I'm pretty positive this is a top. Okay, first things first, this feels so nice. I've just taken it out of the bag. Ugh, and it feels really, really soft. So this is the wee top. Oh, that's so cute. That's so sweet. Look at it. It is a wee bit see-through. But you know what? This with like little blue shorts in the summertime would be so cute. It also has that same sort of like scrunch bit so you can have it more cropped in the middle if that's sort of the look you're going for. Um, if it's not. So far, most of this has actually felt really good quality. Okay, so here's this little white top. It's actually so cute. It's so soft as well. Um, I wanted to tie it up and like tie it in a bow or something. I think that would be really cute. Tie it up and then. I don't like the fact that I would hang down, that's my thing. But I feel like if I'd like tuck it away, nobody would know. But yeah, I feel like gone. So this is so cute. Like, see when we can actually do things in summer. Um, I've also got a white brown one under it. I don't actually think it's too see through. Um, I know white can be super see through. It's actually alright, I think. Um, the next thing I ordered was this wee top. It's just a little brown. Like, I can't see any reason why this won't be okay. So it's just a little brown. So, are they called racer neck tops or whatever? It feels really thick, actually. Um, I've got a few tops like this from Pretty Little Thing. They're quite thin, but those are like summertime ones. I feel like this one you could wear in the winter layered with something and it'd be fine. This is in a size medium again. So I think most of it's probably going to be in a medium. Um, this one does look quite tiny, but I think it looks quite tiny because it's like a small top. So we'll see how that one looks. Okay, so I've ended up showing my head up. I don't want to talk about it. This is the first little brown top. Um, obviously, I'm wearing a different bra. But it's really nice. It's so soft. On. I think it's that nice crop. Sometimes things are too cropped where they sit like here and then your bra hangs out and then sometimes things are like that awkward length where they're not really cropped but they're not really long. But yeah, I honestly don't have any complaints so far. I'm really liking everything. Okay, so the next thing, right. If you've been anywhere on the internet, Instagram, TikTok, Facebook, YouTube, you will have seen this top. So this is the little Bratz style honey top. Um, got a wee cut out in the back which I didn't notice. This is also in a size medium, yeah. You know what, it actually feels really stretchy and see if this looks nice. I am gonna be really living it up. Um, big bit of fluff on it. That's a bit, it's not ideal. Um, the only thing I'm worried about is how this would be in the wash. Like, okay, hold on. I don't know how well you can see it, come a bit closer. It is like fully, like little gems and stuff. So I don't know how that will be in the wash. But I think I've got some like brown leather trousers from Zara with this. I think it would look so nice. So fingers crossed it's nice. <laughs> really do understand the hype. Honestly, this is so nice. Again, a bit concerned about washing it. I also just showed it to mom and she was like, do you not already have that? And I was like, no. She was like, she was looking at me. I was like, it's like the brattest font. And she was like, did you have something like that when you were like six? Yes, mom, probably. But that's not the point. So that wee bit in the back I think is a nice wee touch as well. But the quality feels great, like I have no complaints. This one's more cropped than um, the first brown top was. You know what, I think this one suits being quite cropped as well because it's got that detailing on the front. I just think it's so pretty. I'll just move on to this because it's the same top as, not the previous one I've just shown you but the one before that but in lilac um you know what this one feels a wee bit different I don't know whether it's just me being a bit funny so that's the brown one and that's the lilac one no they actually feel the same 
not sure I like this one as much. <laughs> no, I think I do. I do really like Lilac at the moment. Um, obviously, if you watch my Motel Rocks video, that's quite clear. Um, so this is just that wee top. It's really stretchy. That's the thing I've noticed about all these tops so far. They've all been really stretchy, um, which is quite a good sign. Because although, again, with Shein, the size and small, medium, large, which, as I've stated in previous videos, I'm not the biggest fan of. The good thing about them being stretchy means there's more chance that they're going to fit more people. Um, this top is so nice. I'm not sure what, like, I think I'd probably style this with blue jeans, right? Blue shorts, something like that. I just think it's so nice. It's so simple, like, it's so easy to wear. Like, you can not really see the shape of my bra through either, which I find is quite an issue with these tops. But... Oh, this one's really nice as well. So next I'll try this. This one's really heavy, like straight off the bat. I think this is one of the wee jumpers that I've ordered. Yep, definitely is. Right, so. Something that's really in style at the moment is like cropped, like zip up hoodies. Just showing that I had the hood. So this says on the front, North Shore, Hawaii. I don't know why like it's such a common thing to do that, wearing like <laughs> clothes with like American places, like states on them. Whereas like, you wouldn't do that for like most other places in the world. Anyways, very strange. This is quite tiny. It's a medium. Right, the zip seems to be alright. Um, I must say the inside doesn't feel great. It's not like the softest material I've ever felt. But again, for the price that I paid for it. I can't really complain. See, that's the thing I, in my opinion with Shein. Because of how little you're paying for it. You're like, can I really complain if things aren't exactly how you want them to be? So, you know what, I actually think this will be quite cute. I think this, see, even going to the gym, just like putting this on on top. Right, so here's the first little hoodie. The inside of it doesn't feel great. Um, It's just plain on the back. But I don't know whether, like, I don't know if you can see it, but it's just like a bit scratchy. I don't know whether maybe, like, if you wash it, it'll feel better. Um, the hood, it's a fine hood, I just look a bit silly, but... Well, sometimes you get hoods for stuff and the hood like stops like heating you like, like that um the zip works fine i think it's, it is like a perfectly average jumper um i think it's totally fine okay so the next thing i think this is the other wee jumper that i've ordered to try to sorry this is gonna be really dent. um i didn't want to get like i have pretty much got only tops and like two dresses there i wanted to get more things that were a bit more like out of my comfort zone. Looking at this right now, I don't remember ordering this. <laughs> so it's a little um like quarter zip that says Chicago on it again with the American places and it kinda like scrunch not scrunches but like cinches in at the bottom. I don't remember ordering this but I probably did. So Okay so here's the other little jumper. I've just sorted out the confusion because it's folded like this. And the folds, you know what? I am obsessed with this. I've just got it tucked up a wee bit. I think you could wear it a wee bit longer. But you know what? Actually, oh my god, I've been trying for months to do the like oversized jumper and tennis skirt look, and it's just not been working out for me. And I think I might have just found like the perfect sort of top to wear with it. So this next piece that I've ordered was quite interesting. So basically, it's this little crop top. Um, what's it saying? California. I'm a surprise no, I'm not. But it's um got some purple like design on it. So in this set you got trousers as well. So these are the trousers look like they're like sort of cargo style trousers. I'm already looking at these and questioning my choices. I really am. These are a large as well, so they're really quite okay. I'm really quite stretchy. I'm really, you know, what, I just find it really interesting that a lot of stuff on Shein is like a top and trousers together. Um, I don't know about you, but my top half, my bottom half aren't the same size. Although if this crop top is also in a large, it's not very long. Like I don't know whether it's the one of the ones that like your bra hangs out the bottom, but it's like supposed to. Anyways. I'll see how this looks. I hope it looks cool. Like I really want to look cool, but I don't think it will. <laughs> okay, so here's the old cord. 
The first I show up in face buffers is like no pockets. Like there's pockets in here, but obviously like I'm not gonna stand with this. I mean, <laughs> but anyways, you know what? This is a lot nicer than I expected it to be. The head hole was really tiny. That's the only thing. But I think it's meant to be quite a, like a high neck top. Um, I can almost lift my arms up um, without flashing. I think. No, I couldn't lift my arms up in this top. But obviously, if I was wearing something like this, I'd maybe wear like a sports bra or something under it, so that like I wouldn't be like naked. Um, yeah, I really like it. I'm not a huge fan of this. Like the noises the trousers are making. I don't know what I expected from this material. Um, lengthwise, uh, let's not talk about my socks. They're actually fine. I really like this. I don't think I can pull it off. But then I don't know. I think with my buffaloes, the right hair, the right makeup, this could look really cool. Okay, so the last clothing item I have are some shorts. So I really must have been feeling bold when I put this order through because these are denim shorts but how cute are they? Like you either love cow print or you hate it, like I totally get that. Um, I love it, I think it's so cute. So these are the back, these are the front. I've mentioned it in about 17 videos at this point. I'm going on holiday, hopefully. And I have a little cow print bikini top and with these it would just look so cute. So fingers crossed they fit. They have little to no stretch them they're supposed to be really high waisted they look a very strange shape that's the only thing i'm gonna say i can't judge them too much until i try them on though so i got this purely because i thought okay i'm gonna i'm feeling this right now the quality feels awful i won't lie like so it's a little anklet i'll just show you it before we start chatting absolute rubbish you can see that it feels like i don't know if anyone will know what i'm on about those bracelets that you used to get when you were younger that would get caught in your arm hair and it would really hurt. It feels like one of them. I'm not sure about this one. Um, I'll, say I, I'll come back to you once I've tried everything on and do like my final thoughts but yeah I'm not sure on this. I've just tried everything on hence the current state of me and I've kept this on because it's so comfy. Um, So you may have noticed I didn't try on these shorts basically they fit everything's fine they are so incredibly tight because they're that way you know when you get brand new denim and it's so stiff that like you can't move so i'm gonna have to wash them a few times before i wear them but i'll update you with me wearing them on my instagram or something or in a later video so my final verdict on Shein. i haven't even bothered trying this on um this looks like kids costume jewelry i will be 100 percent honest I have had what what am I saying? I have bought jewellery from Shein before. Like the earrings that I've got in my cartilage right now. And my nose ring my nose stud are from Shein. Um and I really like them, so I did have my hopes up about this. But no, it is like very kids costume jewellery, so I can't say I'm a huge fan of that. Overall, I think I would probably give Shein an eight out of ten. Um the price point is great to be honest like I don't think I paid any more than like 10-15 pounds for like an individual item um, as well as that. Shipping, it came much quicker than I thought it was gonna as well and Shane you also get loads of discount codes like all the time as well. Um, I'm not a huge fan of the sizing, I'll say it, on, I'll say it a million times, I don't like when things are sized in small, medium, large, I don't think it's helpful I don't think it's very inclusive um life goes on uh, it's just me nitpicking at this point um but yeah I've actually really enjoyed everything I will be keeping everything from this haul I don't think I, I don't even know how she and returns work anyway I've never returned anything from Shein but I think my favorite piece I didn't do this in the last one but I'm actually going to start doing this I think it's quite nice um this because it's just so comfy or I'm gonna have to say the she on top that literally everybody, their mum, their dad, their gran has. But okay, so that's the end of today's video. I hope you enjoyed. Um, I hope you're enjoying this little series so far. I know I'm enjoying it. I love trying on clothes. But if you've got any recommendations, um, any places you want me to try anything like that, if you just comment them down below. 
Um, if you want to like and subscribe, that would be much appreciated. And I'll see you in the next one. Bye.